these different ideologies and these different things is just a mirage. But the the end battle is gonna be good versus evil, and there is no middle ground. You can be like, oh, I don't go to church, but I'm not I'm not part of. Welcome to another episode of the Valentine Show. Expecting you guys are having a wonderful and blessed day. Let's get into Little Nas X dropping a sneaker with real blood in it. First of all, who's Little um Little Nas X. It's a rapper, a, a black rapper. I guess uh he, he came to fame with this song uh Old Town Road, uh very heavily promoted to children. Um he came to fame in that he came out as being gay, etc. And then it's it, it seemed like it just went down down to hell from there, like literally, as we're gonna get into all that. So this is him right here for the people that have no idea who this rapper is, this guy right here. He's selling this sneaker. This is a brand new sneaker coming out, um, and, and and it's not it's it's not in conjunction with Nike. Some stories did come out saying at least one that I read came out saying that this was in conjunction with Nike. Thank God, because if not, I had to cut Nike out too, right? So this is not coming out with Nike. This is coming out with another company that um, we're gonna get into. We're gonna be getting into exactly what all this means here. Um, the Luke uh, 1018, we're going to be reading that, the signals here, and the 666, all that stuff. But before we get into all that stuff, let me just give you a, a Bible verse. Um, for the people that think that we're all children of God, we are not all children of God. You, you, people will have this misconception that they think that we, I'm good, I'm good. No, you are not good. The Bible says that we have all fallen, all of each and every one of, uh, of us. It said, and the Bible says that there is none that is good. None, none, none. You might be good to human standards, I believe you, but you're not good to God's standard. And who puts the standards? Humans put it? Because everybody has a different standard of good. So if we all go by the different standard of good, then there will be no <clears throat> standard of good because everybody had, will have a different one. The standard is set by God. And God says that even the ch the devil has children. Little non sex is a, ch a child of the devil. And look what it says here on John 8, 24, 8, 44. Sorry, let me prove that to you. You belong to your father, the devil. And you want to carry out your father's desires. He was a murderer from the beginning, not holding to the truth for the, there is no truth in him. When he lies, he speaks in his native language for he is a liar and the father of lies. So little Nas X is uh, um, uh, giving worship to his, his, his father, right? The devil, Le the imagery. This is the box that it comes in. Um, and uh, they, let me let me zoom it in here a little bit. Let me see what I got. The, there you go. Zoomed in a little bit here. You see this picture right here? It looks like it's a demon. A demon is carrying Jesus. If this is a demon and this is Jesus, which that's what it seems like it is, this is a a a, a whole uh what what you call it um uh a whole disrespect to the Lord to God right um. But again, this is what these people do. They're the children of the devil. They're coming out out here, right? So that's that. Obviously, you guys see the pentagram out here. This is the sign shown for that, that the saying is used to one of their signals, right? We have the cross. They have the pentagram. That's that's dumb. And as you guys saw here, um, it also has Luke 10, 18. And there are going to be 666 pairs made. 666 is the number in the book of Revelations, the last book of the Bible where... It uh talks about the end times and it talks about uh, the false prophet and 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 the antichrist and the number given to the antichrist is six hundred and sixty six. So there's going to be six hundred and sixty six pairs of these uh sneakers made that are going to be sold. Actually, let me get the they're going to be sold at a thousand eighteen dollars and they're gonna be they're gonna be dropping tomorrow the 21st I'm, I'm pretty sure they're gonna sell like hotcakes because um humanity is like that humanity is evil don't you just see it all around you this is what they're worshiping and i tell you guys all the time guys this is the real battle here the battle is here but these these different ideologies and these different things is just a mirage but the the and battle is going to be good versus evil. And there is no middle ground. You can be like, oh, I don't go to church, but I'm not, I'm not 
part of the devil. Actually, the Bible says that, that if you are not with God, you are against God. And how do you know you're with God? There's only one way. There's no 10 ways. There's no 10 different ways to get to heaven. There, there, there's none of that. There's only one way. You repent of your sins and you believe that Jesus Christ is the son of God and you follow his teachings. That's it. That's, that's what it takes for you to be adopted into the kingdom of heaven. Because right as of right now, standing right now, if you haven't repented from your sins and don't recognize Jesus Christ as the son of God, you are on the side of the devil. I know it sounds like, wow, Valentine, you're calling me evil. No, I'm not calling you evil. The Bible is calling you evil. <laughs> That's the, the rules that the Bible says. Now, talking about the Bible, they make a horrible mistake when they put this Bible verse on it. Luke 10, 18. What is that in reference to? Well, let's let's read what Luke 10, 18. But we're going to read a couple verses before that. This is, again, this is Luke, the book of Luke. Um chapter 10 as you guys see it but with the big number and the verse we're going to be reading uh 18 where it says here you guys see i saw saying a full like lightning from heaven but who's speaking we need context to this verse so we got to read a little bit before maybe two or three verses before that way we know who's speaking the person speaking here is jesus and the context is that jesus has sent 72 uh, <clears throat> uh people to preach uh in front of him were in the different towns that he was going and he gave authority to them to heal them from the sick to cast out demons all that stuff and when they come back they say hey jesus they are actually we are doing all these things that you told us of course I, it's happening jesus responds because um i'm jesus and i saw satan <laughs> being cast down from heaven when when satan was cast down from heaven was when jesus defeated uh heaven uh when jesus defeated satan in heaven right satan is an angel of light right uh and he was he, he rebelled from from because he wanted power he wanted glory he wanted all that um envy a hater from the beginning satan um he wanted all that and jesus was like not happening papa <laughs> cast down to earth where he's been uh, running amok ever since and but his time is coming up so he's talking about this so they put that verse like it's a this is i guess like a a thing of glory or something good no that's negative that, that he's talking about his defeat <laughs> there let's read a little bit look whoever listens to you listens to me whoever rejects you rejects me but whoever rejects me rejects him who sent me also this is jesus talking the 72 returned with joy and said lord even the demons submit to us in your name and jesus replied look what jesus replied i saw satan fall like lightning from heaven i have given you authority to trample on the snakes and scorpions and to overcome all the power of the enemy nothing will harm you again jesus is saying this that bro i did this to heaven to to satan of course the demons are gonna are gonna uh follow what you say because you're doing it in my name plain and simple and um this is crazy where the world is headed but this i mean it's expected we know where the world is headed we know that the world is loving uh uh more of evil people and and go go check out the, the video that he dropped man i'm not even going to show you guys that video on, on this channel because it's just uh revolting to be honest it's uh sickening in my opinion when he's lap dancing on the devil and all that stuff which is just like so weird and it's more than weird it's it's, it's um it's like it's um i don't even know how to describe it to be honest it's just crazy it looks uh very very revolting in my opinion but i'm gonna pass the question off to you to you what do you guys think um let me know in the comments remember to hit that like we're trying to grow the channel guys and only with your help absolutely with nobody else we're gonna make it happen share this video don't be afraid to share the truth this is the battle that is coming to and you better pick a side because you already have <laughs> believe if you if you if you don't know that god bless god speed me valentine i am out